Hey buddy, feel like tripping your balls off today? Cause that's what's gonna happen in this episode, just like every other episode of the game, Null Pot. Played with me, Dr. B. Mm. Yes. Now. What the fuck? Damn it, I have to do this shit again. Well, let's get that over with. And we're done. Ah, hard to believe it took a whole episode last time, isn't it? Now we're just here in the hyperdimensional railroad to the dark, dark future. And we're going to the future and we're eating these little black squares because they're part of a nutritious breakfast. Delicious. Come here, all of you. I will eat you. Mmm. And this is how we make some progress. Jump. Jump. Don't you love bitch? I love bitch. Uh, not bitches like the female dogs, but bitch like an 8-bit. Although if you have 8 bitches, that might not... I, no, I don't think that's the same thing. Son of a bitch. I will succeed. Where others have also succeeded. So I'm really no better than any of them. But. I'm at least just as good. Maybe. Hello? <gasps> Oh my gosh, is this the end of the game where I meet Cube? That would suck, because I wanted to play so much more of this. Anyways, Cube. Hello. Um, hi. So you're the Cube, I guess? Yes, I came here to warn you. Stop destroying my shelters. It's not me! Not only you, no. You and your friend, Paul. Alright, alright. I promise I won't do it again. You're free to roam on the outside. But don't ever come back on any of my islands. I'm gonna kick you in the face. Jump, jump, damn it. I can't use my face kick abilities. But I can use my teleportation! Where the hell am I? Am I on another one of your islands? What the hell was that? I just walked inside myself? Fuck. Time to get out. And look at my glorious crotch face chin. Oh well. Let's talk about this guy. How you doing? Where did you come from? I never saw you before. I came from outside. Outside? I thought I heard that nobody was allowed to come in anymore. Yeah, well, I have special permission from the cube. Oh, really? Is there any way we could verify that? Just ask the cube next time you'll see him. Uh huh. In any case, glad to meet you. See ya. How about you, red guy? I heard, like, you know, I guess someone said, like, you know, the cube said something in the sort of, like, about something about somewhere. You know, like, here or someplace that, you know, it's sort of like someplace in the, you know. That place was, like, you know, some kind of something. Like, built or something, you know, the whole place by some, like, you know, like, by someone or something or, like, you know what I'm saying? No. I didn't quite get that. Could you, like, you know, make it clear for me? Like, something or someone, the cube, you know? He said, like, some sort of, like, you know. Ah, uh, never mind. I hate people to talk like that. All of this is hard to understand, and really hard to accept. Just before arriving here, I was at my wedding. The priest was about to declare us husband and wife, and suddenly, because of poor turbulences, our love manifested itself physically as a kind of sprawling, multicolored light. It was the most beautiful thing I ever saw and ever will see. And now, I'm here all alone. That sucks, dude. Is this your husband? Maybe you just can't recognize him. I'm worried. <gasps> I know Gargant. He's a fat ass. I'm worried for my friend Gargant. The guy who guards the chests in the holes. Someone stole his objects twice, and it's starting to affect him a lot. He's starting to have suicidal thoughts. Man, that's so sad. If I ever see him, I'll try to cheer him up. Ah, oh, thanks, dude. That's really generous of you. You're a great guy. You know what? We gotta give him that teddy bear. This teddy bear. We're gonna be nice and give it to him. Even though you know, we're supposed to be taking it from him. Because Gargan's a nice guy, right? It's not his fault he's got a shitty job. I shouldn't be making his life worse. How you doing? Shit! I'll end up falling left and right. Damn maniacs are destroying everything. The cube's gonna have to do better than that, otherwise we're fucked. At least to reinforce these damn fences. How about you? You know what's going on here? Oh, you do? Well, please, tell me. We're all dead and this is hell. 
The perturbulence is that was the apocalypse. When you die, you can't know for sure that you're dead. That's how hell works. I'll try forever to get out, but you'll never succeed. This is why hell is the worst of torches. Let me get this straight. Nobody knows that they're dead except for you. Yeah, I know, but I'm dead, I know. Ah. You will always have to find a way to make yourself feel special, don't you? Maybe take that stick out your ass and you'll get some places. How about you? You look like a bodybuilder. If Pyramid Head was a bodybuilder. How you doing? Damn. We're raiding after a fucking cube and a giant X to save us from a place that I don't even... Where my arms went to see some guy named Richard is a nice guy. He likes to disguise himself as a sunny day on the highway to be a rotating, boiling, road advice fishing, simultantric, ardent, tropy, hungry, fish, sensi, clementine, escapableness, and garga fuck. I'm not sure I quite got that. Me neither. The guy's blowing the shelters that cube has so nicely built. I understand him. I'm starting to want to fuck everything up too. To light it on fire. This place is bullshiterational sex and mental cover. Shit! Ah, that guy has funny lingo. I like him. How are you? I already talked to you. I don't even care anymore. Well, time to go ruin that X's day. Uh, yeah, the, the, all the labyrinths are controlled by a giant X. And all the sound places have Gargant, the nice fat ass bodyguard. He's actually quite a nice fellow. I feel bad about stealing his crap. But I really do. Son of a bitch. Oh my gosh, I'm getting a headache from this. Oh damn, please stop spinning. Thank you, but now I'm all sideways and shit. No! Why did you start spinning again? Okay. I'm good. We gotta figure a way out of this. I can't move! I can't freaking move! What the hell? Alright, well... Oh shit, I think there might be an audio delay now. Either way, what the fuck is with our face? Son of a face, how are you doing? All of this is hard to extend, and really hard to accept. Right, you look different from the one who got married last time. Either way, we still need to steal from that ex. You should flee while you still can, or stay! An intruder! My master's right, he's no liar. Get out of my sight! Do all you bastards rhyme? You guys trying to slow me down? Well, you can't get this. You can't stop the rock. Wrong, wrong guy. I'm not the rock. Either way, I am unstoppable. Don't touch me. You better leave now. You staying here? I cannot allow. You rhyming bastards. Hey, you're not supposed to be here. Get out. Or I'll make you disappear. I doubt you can make me disappear, you little yellow muffin. I don't know insults. I don't even know what the hell these guys are. Damn it, he's reinforced his maziness. I'll never be a whoa. Damn it, man, I hate spinning. It hurts my brain. I need my brain to not spin. Come on. Get in the green. Yellow? No, damn it. Wait, that looks like a thing. It's not a thing. I thought it might be a secret door. But it's not. Which sucks. Because I really must be finding that treasure. But I cannot find that treasure. Perhaps I am thinking too linearly. I always assume that the treasure is up. Set up, Labiro, before I tackle your shit. But perhaps the treasure is down. For a maze is a maze, after all. You're just standing there. An intruder! My master is right. He's no liar. Get out of my sight. Ah, you and your bitch-ass rhymings. They not even dropped the beat yet, yo. Stop it. You're embarrassing yourself. Ah. No, don't kill me. You must find... I'm trying to flee, but you will keep chasing me. See, I can rhyme too. Moo. Let's go left. Or is this right? No, don't kill me! Up! I don't know where to go, dude! Stop getting all pissed at me! What about you, huh? You're not giving me directions or anything? Maybe? Nope, that's not gonna help me. Dang it, I hate spinning! You give me a fucking headache! Stop it, please! 
Oh, this is why I need Alka Seltzer. Uh, I'm still thinking way too light. Son of a bitch! No, don't hit me! Don't hit me! Oh gosh, it's so much worse when you're zoomed. Oh, that's a really detailed, weird little portrait character. What the hell? What in the hell? Oh, my fucking head hurts now. You monster. Whoa! Did I just teleport? Where am I? I'm lost is where I am. But I suppose I sort of expected to get lost in a maze. I mean, it's a freaking maze. No, don't come at me! Maybe I have to kill all these guys and then... Whoa. And then I'll... Then I'll be able to leave. Properly. Fuck, I can't think straight. My foot looks weird as shit. Oh my giblet. <sighs> Come here, blue. Damn it. Okay, relax. Use your knowledge of knowledge to learn. Knowledge that will assist you in escaping from this maze. You can do this, Dr. B. You can do this, said Dr. B to himself on that fateful day. And lo and behold, the doctor did not disappoint. For within the very second he said that, the glorious entryway had appeared miraculously, had appeared miraculously before. Where the fuck is it? I've been all these places before, and none of them lead correctly to areas that I need to lead to. None of them. Not a single one. You'd think I would have memorized the place by now, but I haven't. I'm still lost. Ding dong ding a ling fong. And there are numbers. So many damn numbers. Unimportant numbers. Teleport. Teleport me. Damn yo. Where the hell do I go? There's nowhere to go, man. There seriously isn't. This place is one big loop. It's a very well put together loop, but it's just a loop. And things do not lead anywhere. It's like the Twilight Zone without the Twilight. It's just a zone. And like all zones, it is infinite. Except for the zone I. No, I'm kidding. I don't even know if I'm kidding. What the hell am I talking about? I think I read it in a book somewhere. Oh, I'm so fucking lost. Thank you for watching. Hopefully I will figure out where I'm supposed to go by the next episode, but I probably won't. But thank you for watching me. God dang it. Uh, what the? Ah, son of... Bye now.